It was a battle of two teams right in the middle of the President's Athletic Conference when Chatham visited Waynesburg at the Rudy Marisa Fieldhouse. The Jackets and Cougars were close in the early stages of the game before Waynesburg went on a 13-0 run with shots like these from Isaiah Alonzo and Jansen Knotts. In the waning minutes of the first half, Waynesburg led by 21, their largest of the night. However, keep this shot in mind. A buzzer beater from Chatham's Simone Boyer. At this point, it was the highlight of the Cougars' night. What it became was ultimately the turning point. Bit by bit, Chatham clawed back before tying the game at 61 with just under four minutes left. How this happened was no mystery to head coach Tim Fusina. I didn't see any big adjustment that they made that hurt us. We took bad shots. You know, we were five of 30 in the second half at 16 to 16 percent. So, you know, we took we took some bad shots. We were one of eight from three. That's 12 percent. The Jackets fell 66-64 in a heartbreaking loss. Isaiah Alonzo led the team with 23 points. Matt Popek had 17 on the night. Waynesburg took the lessons from this game to an upset win on the road three days later at W&J. Popek had 13 in that contest, and a spotlight on him from Adam Morganti can be found at theyellowjacket.org. The Jackets will travel to Teal on Saturday for WCTV. I'm Bruce Davidson.